back at a place that we've hit before and it's been so dry and everything, but we had some good rain here, so signals are a little better. And I got this one and when I first saw the edge of it, I thought, oh man, it's a lot of sand, but it's not. I can't tell what that is. I cleaned it off some here to try to identify it. It's got a hole here, it looks like. Uh, it's got a horse, looks like, on the front. We dug one of those Boy Scout tokens, but this doesn't look like that. This looks, this looks different. Well, I'm going to have to clean that up and see if I can identify it. I don't know what it is, but I really like it. Okay, we'll be back. A guy and I uh, came back to this yard the other day where I got the large scent. We had nice rain, and here's a, I just dug another big copper, but it's not a large scent. I can't tell, maybe some big token or something. It almost looks a little bit like that one I dug in the other yard just a while ago. I don't know what it is. But like on that other one, I sure do like it. Okay, we'll be back. We're still in that same uh, yard was earlier, and uh, hadn't been finding much, but I just got a 12.35, thinking that was probably a zinking because it's only a couple inches deep, maybe, maybe three or so, but it's an Indian. I think I see 1883, but I'll have to confirm that. Okay. That's always good. We'll be back. I really haven't been finding much since that Indian head a while ago, but I just dug this plate here. I don't know what it is. I think it's brass. It's got fancy. Probably some furniture piece. All I know is I like it. Okay, we might be back with more. <laughs> 